Welcome back viewers, welcome back viewers. I don't know whether this is too early, but allow me to say I wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. I hope that your year becomes a year of power. That informs my topic today. My name is Jonah Simba and I'm talking about the power of the year 2024. My sign language interpreter is Jedida Wafula. You need to have faith. You need to have hope. Be hopeful. Is, has anything taken away your hope for the year 2024? Let your hope be restored. May the year 2024 be the year of restoration, the year of restoration of your soul. Energy begins from you, from the inside of you. Yeah? You need hope. You need hope. Gain hope again. When I spoke about the power of prayer, I was speaking about God. Just the fact that God is alive, that should give you hope. Just the fact that you're alive, that should give you hope. Just the fact that you have the ability to fashion something after God. You know, you have the ability to form a family. You have the ability to teach somebody something good, to be positive, you know, to transform lives for God. That should give you hope. You know, you should be the channel, the door. Yeah, lift up ye gates and open up ye everlasting doors. I see you as a door, an opening. You know, you are opening up new things into the year 2024. May it be that blessings will flow through you into the year 2024 and touch not just you, but the lives of many. Yeah, you are a door. You know, and once God opens a door, nobody can shut it. You are opened for the year. Nobody can shut you. You know, you've been opened up. You have a beginning with no ending. You have a spirit. The spirit can only come from God. You carry a soul and you live in a body. That tells me something. You have the ability to carry God on the inside of you. On the year, in the year 2024, may you be the door that many can access blessings through you. You are a leader. You are a leader. Start discovering your roles, your responsibilities. You know, in your roles lies your cross. Yeah, in your responsibilities lies your cross. Do not give up in times when you carry crosses. You carry some crosses, but one thing about these crosses, burdens, the burdens of God are easy. The burdens of God are not heavy. When you are carrying something to transform people's lives, clothing the naked, feeding the hungry, these are easy burdens. Somehow you will gain satisfaction out of them. But things that are evil, that take up life from others, will always kill you and destroy you and leave you weaker. Whenever you move into negativity, after you've moved in anger or lust, after you've moved into a negative emotion of strife or something, think of a negative emotion. What comes after is lack of energy. You feel powerless. You feel restless. You feel like you are energyless. You need renewal. You need to take up some sugar or some energy. You know, that is what happens. But whenever you do something positive, it releases energy to you. That is the secret for the year 2024. Carry emotional intelligence with you. There is a lot of positivity, a lot of energy in forgiveness. Walk in forgiveness. Let go. Just let it go. May forgiveness be your secret. Move with that key in the year 2024. 2024. Whenever you are wronged, be quick to forgive. Be quick to let it go. Don't carry people. You will be heavy. Don't carry offenses. Whenever you are offended, let it go very quickly because you are a door. Offenses have a tendency of closing doors of blessings. What are blessings? Blessings are just that easiness, the oil, the ability to operate easily, to access financial favor, to access emotional favor, to be at peace and joy. You know, when you, when, when you are a door of positivity, you embrace blessings. You know, I'm looking at it from your health. These are blessings. When you're in good health in body, when your blood is in good health, your bone is in good health, your tissues, 
There is something that happens when you're not moving in fear or negativity on the inside. You have some peace of mind. At the end of, of the day, your conscience is clear. They may have wronged you or carried you you know, negatively. They may have pretended to be your mirrors. They may have tried to describe you to the world, to paint you wrongly. But when your conscience is clear, it releases some love and trust of God and trust in yourself to you. That is when there is authentic power in you. Somebody who discovers who they are is very, <laughs> is very dangerous for the evil world. They will never be stopped. They are free on the inside. You can be chained on the outside. You can be painted negatively, but once you're free of mind, your conscience is clear. That is why you should fight for the reins of righteousness throughout the year 2024. Do your best to embrace justice. Do not be moved to injustice. Move towards justice. Look for positivity, forgiveness. Look for love. Look for virtues, you know, uh, positive things. They will release those blessings to your health of body, soul, and mind. They will release psychological strength. You will be psychologically uh, strong despite the psychological games of the world. You know, you may be through power struggles. There may be people who may want to make you be down throughout 2024. But you need to be 10 times wiser. Power struggles are true. There are people that may want to associate you with failure and power difficulties. Don't find yourself in power struggles. You know, be out of power struggles. Move out of power struggles, triangles. You know, you, you need to understand what power struggles are. You know, psychologically, you're fighting for political power, control of powers that are, you know, unnecessary strife, things that are far from you. Stay away from them. Be clear. Be clear in your mind of exactly what you need. This is, these are the secrets for you for 2024 to move in the blessings. You know, these are blessings, easiness in your spiritual life. Do not move in witchcraft. Come on, we are in Africa. Don't go into witchcraft. Don't kill people with witchcraft. No. You know, do away with superstitions. Don't move to witch doctors. These are negativities, spiritual powers that will push you behind. I'm talking to people, in, especially in the third world country, in Africa especially. In the year 2024, move towards godliness, holiness, yearn for positivity. Do not be condemned. Leave people alone. Let them go. Do not go and kill people, you know, in terms of uh, characters, you know, assassinating characters. These are things that will um, come back to you. These are things that will follow you and bring you down. I'm speaking to you about blessings. These are things that will release energy to you. You may look like you're winning a battle, but you're losing the war, especially when you move in negative spiritual powers. You know, I'm talking about dark powers. Do away with these things in 2024. Embrace relationships. Do not be quick to break relationships. Be very quick to hold on to relationships. Broken relationships can bring poverty. There are people in your life that will make you rich and richer. Trust you me. There are people that will bring abundance to you. There are people that will receive your phone call when you're broken on the inside. Do not be quick to, to push them away. Be very quick to build bridges with people. Work out with the art of influence. Don't lose relationships. Let it go when, it, when you have nothing to do with it. You know, there are people that will not like you. Let them go. But those people that you know love you. You know, when you discover love, don't be quick to let love go. You know, the things that are wins for you. If you've won a marriage or won a relationship, those are things that don't come easy. True friends don't come easy. When you have true friendships, don't let it go. Do your best to maintain it. Visit. Visit your friends. Visit them. Do your best to maintain it. You know, you know, people don't just give. Do, people don't just give. When you see somebody give you 1,000, 2,000 shillings, 10,000 shillings, it doesn't just come like that. People give out of the things that they have thought over. You know, it, 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 people give out of things of the issues of the heart. You know, start creating a place where you can be given. You start by giving, giving yourself. Look like you, you are somebody that somebody will not run away from. There are people that when you discover they have some habits, run away from them. 
you know, these are secrets for the year. Don't hold on to evil relationships, things that will influence you negatively. You know, I'm talking about maintaining you. Relationships are key. You know, beyond just uh, athlete gains, look for permanent relationships. I'm speaking about things that will break you into business, you know, into your work life. You know, do your best at your workplaces. Do your best. To, to maintain relationships and to be the best that you can be. Ah, genuine faith will carry a genuine reward. One thing about these things is that at the end of the year 2024, they will reward you. They will reward you. Somehow you will find a reward. There will be a crown. Genuine faith carries a crown, either in time or in eternity. Do not be cheated. Negativity will come out. Whatever you sow today, you will reap. If you reap positively, if you sow positively, you will reap positively. Sow the right things. Do it, even if no one is seeing it. Sow it in secret. You will reap it in public. I wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy 20. 24 a prosperous one indeed see you next week on the treasures of life show bye